Hello and welcome! My name is Geo from SwitchRPG.com. We're playing SteamWorld Quest today. It has been a long, long while. Actually, I'm looking at the calendar. It's been about three months since I've last played this. Now, one thing I probably should have done is, is maybe kind of just get back into shape. Just kind of figure things out. And maybe just go back and play a little bit. But I'm not. I'm going back into this completely blind again. So, you'll be relearning it with me. I just kind of wanted to revise, or I'm sorry, revive this series. And I also wanted to finish it, because I actually like the game. I love the art style. I love all this stuff. Um, and just to kind of change things up a little bit. I've been playing the same games for a while, so. Steam World Quest, episode 12. Here we go. This is getting ridiculous. I'm pretty used to rugged terrain. If you ever need a ride, just let me know. And also, I implore you to go back and watch from the very beginning, if you can. Again, I'm 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 relearning. I'm relearning here. All right. Crafting, crafting, crafting. Hmm. All right. I don't think I'm gonna buy anything quite yet. I I, I wanna. I want to get back into the game first. All right, so I can run. Let's, um, can I go up this way? I'm going to be honest. I don't even know if I'm going the right way. I got to be now, right? Headmistress Hyapathia? Now this is a pleasant surprise. Neophyte Copernica. This must be your first visit since you left the college. Okay. Professor Hyop... Can I shorten it to something? Um, maybe Hyopath? Hya? Hya! Professor Hya. Actually, it is his Headmistress Hya. Now. Hmm. I just love how it rolls off the tongue. Hmm. Oh, great. Don't tell me I'm gonna... Get right back into this after three months off right into a boss. I, I mean, this is not going to be good. Hey! We just bashed through a strange gate, a whole hostile school, and some more metal plates just to get here. All because Copernica found out that you, alchemists, are in cahoots with the Void Army. I am pleased to see that my favorite student did not lose her sharp mind. Although most of us will mix with their narrow-minded kind, we are certainly on the same track. In the development of things to come, that is. I don't understand. In all your classes, you always pointed out that alchemy should serve the world. For the good of the people. Among all the absent wandering minds during my lectures, I could always count on your eagerness and full attention. But how does helping the void benefit our world? Science used for personal power through violence? As we know, I never agreed on your suspension. You were different from the rest. We both were. Hiding our true selves under layers of conservative structures. I have led this school down a new path. They all said it was they always said it was so open and inclusive for everybody. Huh. The curriculum was buried under so many rules and regulations, all to benefit the creme de la creme. I may have put a lock on the gate, but at the same time I've revived the school's original core of freedom and exploration. Okay. What is the witch saying here? Huh. The witch is saying that the world is going to undergo some serious changes. Ever heard of Necro... Necronomicog? Necronomicog. Okay. Huh? Your fox-faced friend sure seems to know what it's about. Just as I've changed the school, 
There is a great force out there intent on reshaping the world. The Necrocomic Necrocomicog. The Necronomicog bears the power to alter and manipulate life itself. Not only can it influence what it already grows, it can also create spirit in impotent matters. This is not just some bedtime story, it's the nocturnal dream of the alchemic society. The whereabouts of the Necronomicog have become known. My services have been called upon to assist in awakening it from its slumber. Imagine exploring unlimited power, sending wave after wave of raw, untamed energy through the cosmos. Just thinking about it makes me shiver with anticipation. If this Necronomicon has even half of the powers you describe, how can you even seriously consider using it to manipulate the elements? It seems the structure of this old school is still... It seems the structure of this old school still has you in its grasp. How disappointing. Copernica, I am inviting you to be part of the revolution. Just look at you, ripping through my lock with your restrained potential. Shake your fears, take my hand, and let me guide you. Through the fire, nature is reborn. Yeah, don't do it, Copernica. Our calling is to provide for the good of many. That is what the alchemy is supposed to be about. I won't follow you on this twisted megalomaniac path. Labels, labels, labels. If you're so intent on residing in the submissive part, then let this be a rub to remember. No, come on. Guys, this is, I'm telling you right now, this is probably not going to go good. Uh, <laughs> all right. Mostly, like I said, this is three months off here. So, yeah, let's, let's do that. How do I view what they do? Uh, details, okay. Rebuster. Okay. Let's try that. Conjure Ice Light. You really are doing all the elements, huh? Let's see if I can... I'm gonna do a focus. I'll do a fire pillar, but I wanna get rid of one thing. I'll, I'll swap this one out. Yes, this is kinda what I want. I did want a chain here. I do remember some stuff, but not, not everything. I feel like that didn't do anything. Time lock? That sounds terrible. Alright, well, he can't do anything. So, what does this do? Make him flinch. Okay. So, let's get his turn in on there. What was a fire defense? Alright, let's get rid of his cards. Mostly because it's, he's disabled. No more swaps. Yeah, might as well, right? Uh, who are we gonna fill up? Let's fill up you. Okay, go ahead. Conjuring ice. Lightning. Alright, we're not doing so bad. But you are on fires. Let's give this a shot here. Let's do it. This guy's got a lot of health. Holy cow. Nice. All 
Alright, I need to get this guy poisoned. I love getting these debuffs on them. Um, this is just one hero, one ally. Okay. Let's hang on to that. This is a all ally, alright? Yeah, I'm gonna do that as well. Can I get you something else? I'm not gonna use a flame wave. Ah, come on. Alright, well, he's... No, he's not weak to fire, but... Let's get him lit up again. Alright, cool. So he's poisoned. We're gonna be regenerating health. After every round. Oh, wow. Yeah, we're gonna need... We need some health right now. Alright, let's see if we can get her going. Ah, oh, Brave Buster sounds delicious. What does this do again? Alright, it's just spring. But we need we need a heal, like, now. So let's get rid of you. This will provide us some um, bar barrier, some mana barrier. Active bar- what? Doesn't sound fair. Right, so there's lightning, ice. Right, well, we're recuperating some of that. That's good. Alright, I'm gonna get rid of the flame wave. I Because I only have one enemy. It doesn't make any sense to do. So we're gonna do this. Let's get him going. Or her going, I'm sorry. No. Oh yeah, I do have enough. Let's go here. Do it! Immune to flinch. Alright, well, I gotta pay attention to that now. Immune to... I'm not sure what Lionheart does. I don't really remember. Ah, oh, what does Tinker do? Alright, alright. not going to be helpful if he but it does do a lot of damage so let's let's just go with that let's speed this up too all right we still have health regen oh no oh no that's perfect okay so yeah definitely do that again we're going to do this and this do it to it. Speed it up. Nice. Okay. Let's get her going now. Who needs it? Who needs it? You need it. And bam. And then we'll get a barrier as well. And she gonna go down. She's actually we're doing okay. Doing okay right now. Considering <laughs> I haven't played in a long time. Alright. So we're not gonna need this right now. So I'm gonna actually get rid of it. Put it in the stack. Get rid of that. You're disabled. Alright. Well, yeah, let's... Let's do this. I'm gonna amend you as well. This is gonna... Pretty sure that's gonna. Oh, it just heals. I thought it got rid of conditions too, so let's do this. See if we can get. Oh man, I was hoping for a card. This set him a fire? Yes. Does this one do that as well? No, it just does fire damage. Alright, let's set him up. So we'll have poison damage as well as fire damage. Nice. And you're weak to fire. Perfect. All right, you're gonna have a big attack coming up soon, probably right here. Hmm. 
Anybody need health right now? No, we're not. We're not crazy. Let's get rid of that. Should I do this again? I'm going to hang on to this one. Mm. Let's just go with this. Everybody's getting a turn here. Yeah, you got your big attack. Look at all those cogs. Equalizer? What does that do? Oh man, we need health up there. Alright, we're gonna hang on to that. Searing Lash, make sure you stay on fire. Do this. Can I get... Nice, there we go. Perfect. Might kill her this right here. Ah, uh, maybe not. Immune to everything now? Alright, so you gain haste. Alright, we're gonna have to go. Oh, there we go. So the conditions, that's, they work their magic. That's exactly why I do it. Cool. Dominated by my own student, but still, you leave me disappointed. I'm sorry. Stop saying you're sorry. You beat me. Period. However, your suppressed mind is obviously holding you back. And that makes the affair less spectacular. These are not your true colors, Copernico. All these fears you carry, if you would just let them go. Ding dong, time to sing. The Necronomicog. Where is it? Why would I... Why, would I please you, Cherry? Why would I please you? You're on the wrong side of history. We're going to beat the Void and find the Necronomicog with or without your help, so you might as well... It is not my style to go down yelping like a yelping dog. I end my story by my own strokes. Alright. What, what's, what's going on? Is she getting... Oh, she's taking... What was that? What was that? Did she just disappear? She teleported? <laughs> to the very last. Now, I'm confused. Did she kill herself? Or did she teleport somewhere? Did she really think that I would... She was... Hey, don't know if, that, if it makes you feel any better, but I'm proud of you. She did this herself I know I we must find out what's going on I know how the Necronomicog fits into the, all this the Necro Necronomicog is far more dangerous than all than the alchemist can possibly imagine should it fall into wrong hands the fallout would be cataclysmic not only for the people but for the entire biosphere in fact this location must already be considerably Affected. The resting place of the Necronomicog is a mystery, and without your professor's knowledge on its whereabouts, how will we ever find it? How do you guys know where it is? You've been holding out this whole time? Where we're from, everybody knows about the Necronomicog. It's common knowledge, but even with fading powers. After all this time, the energy of the Necronomicon must have altered its surroundings severely. Well, the wildlife is different than the other parts of the country. Different? Like hillbilly heights different? Do I look like I play the banjo? <laughs> Thanks to ignorant people like the Jolly Green Giant here, outsiders started calling it the Cursed City. And sure enough, the name stuck. There's nothing wrong with the locals. They simply didn't fit in anywhere else, except for the druids. They're shifty as heck. Druids? Never cared much for their methods. Ah, the inclusive alchemy spirit. Yeah, they seem to think they've run the place. They spread out, and I don't know, grab... They spread out, and I, uh, I don't know, grab as much land as they can for their shady business. If what you say is true, 
that we must waste no time in retrieving the grow Namakog. Perhaps the two of you would be so kind to show the way. Well, we do need to push our... We need to push our latest haul. All right. Follow us and don't slack behind. The grown group of heroes decided to travel to the cursed city. Let's go! The book is just writing itself. I'll see you beyond the fire, Professor. Oh, elementary. It deals 180% strength as fire, frost, and storm damage to one foe three times. Nice. I will take that, obviously. Very good. Chapter 10, Act 2. So yeah, we will continue our story in the next episode. I'll try and uh, try and get some more practice in before the next run. Uh, but don't forget to like, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye.